All right, Fieldsy. So, um, the only thing I saw, you know, obviously you're a tremendous player. Just the face looked a little bit, you know, shut to the arc through here. So it looked a little kind of that way, released. And so what'll happen with, with that much of a release through there is if you overturn, obviously, if I've got the thing releasing through here and it's more shut to the arc, then if I turn, it's going left. So in an effort to not have that happen, knowing, knowing that you're gonna release the thing, um, your body at times might start to come out of the shot and block it right. So extension, right over rotation, left, and then we're trying to be somewhere in the middle. So um, I think it's okay. Obviously, you know, Nicholas Watson, those kind of guys kind of release the golf club. Um, but when you look at their body movement, they're more, they got the thing released, but their body's tipped back. So it's like, it's like the club's going in this direction, but my body's feeling like I stay behind it. Now, that's after I move in my center to the low point. I've been posting a little bit about that. So I'm winding up, center, 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 leveling out at my low point. Okay, now club gets released, but on this side of the arc, I don't want to be going with it. I want to be feeling like I'm trying to stay centered through here. So by staying more centered in the body and releasing the hands, the body's playing tug of war with the club head. So the center of your body and the club head are opposing each other, and this helps you keep the club square on your arc through the hit. So it's square here, square here, square here, square here, square here, square here, and then it kind of gets folded up onto your eye line. So one thing you might want to feel is um, if things feel a little bit too thrown in this direction, then obviously, you know, get into the ground a little more, get stronger on the handle, don't let it do this, but at the top side of your bag. Um, so backtrack, eight iron, nine iron wedge, um, you can feel like I'm not releasing it at all, kind of Zach Johnson look. Um, but you know, the faster the swing's going, the harder it is to hold the hands off like that. So top side of your bag driver and that kind of stuff, go ahead and release it, but just make sure your body's not going this way or popping out of it early. So Nicholas talked about, you know, with driver, I feel like I'm, if, as long as the club's coming from the inside and I move to my left side, I start releasing from the top. So he gets it back in front of him and then he stays behind it on the way through. So the face doesn't, continue trending around the corner because as soon as you get it going around like this it wants to keep going over there so you have to have the body in the right place to support the release so that it's more in front of you on the way through um, I hope this ramble helps